hey guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys an amazing hair growth treatment that you can use every week for a faster hair growth if you're new to my channel hi welcome in this channel i do diy videos that can help you to grow your hair using natural ingredients if you enjoyed this video don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel so if you're interested you know what to do grab a seat and let's get into it the first ingredient you're going to need for this hair growth treatment is rosemary leaves I purchased my rosemary leaves from my local store. You can also use dry rosemary leaves, okay? And you can purchase your dry rosemary leaves from Amazon, but I would suggest use fresh rosemary leaves instead. I'm going to go ahead and add the rosemary leaves into a bowl. Then I went ahead and add two cup of water to rinse the rosemary leaves. Once I'm done rinsing the rosemary leaves, I went ahead and transfer it to the blender. The next ingredient we're going to be needing is coconut milk. I'm going to be adding one cup of coconut milk into the blender. Coconut milk helps to repair damaged hair. It increases hair volume. It helps to soften the hair. It prevents hair loss and it adds shine to your hair as well. The next ingredient we're going to be adding to this hair growth treatment is aloe vera. I went ahead and removed the gel from the aloe vera leaves. Aloe vera is amazing and it's going to help you to grow your hair and retain length. I'm also going to be adding ginger to this hair growth treatment. So I started off by removing the skin. Ginger is very powerful ingredient when it comes to hair loss. Ginger helps to reduce hair loss. It treats scalp issues. It helps to stimulate hair growth and it adds shine to your hair as well. So I cut the ginger into small pieces. Then I transfer it to the blender. Once I'm done adding all my ingredients, I went ahead and blend all the ingredients together for a few minutes. After blending all the ingredients, this is how it looks like. Now I went ahead and strained the ingredients out. You can use whatever you have to strain it out. Make sure whatever you are using to strain it out has a very tiny hose because you don't want any particles in your hair from the rosemary leaves. So guys, if you're still watching this video and you haven't subscribed to my channel, please consider subscribing to my channel. In this channel, I do DIY videos that can help you to grow your hair using natural ingredients. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. So this is the reason why I always strain my treatment, okay? If you don't, you're going to have this in your hair. Once I'm done straining the mixture out, this is how it looks like. I'm going to go ahead and add two tablespoons of olive oil. Two tablespoons of cloves and orange peel oil. So if you're interested on how I made these cloves and orange peel, I have the video on my channel. So if you're interested, do check out my channel. I'm also going to be adding one tablespoon of Jamaican black castor oil. Next, I'm going to go ahead and add rosemary and peppermint essential oil. You can add any oil of your choice. Add whatever oil that works best for your hair type. Once I'm done adding all my ingredients, I went ahead and mix all the ingredients together. 
after mixing this is how it looks like now your air growth oil is ready to be used i went ahead and transferred it to my applicator bottle for easy use Now I'm going to show you guys how to apply this hair growth treatment to your hair. So this is what I'm working with, okay? As you guys can see, the hair is really, really dry. So I just went ahead and sectioned the hair into four parts. I sectioned the hair into four sections. I focus on one section at a time. I saturate that section with the treatment, including the scalp. This treatment is very messy, so I would suggest to use clothing or towel you don't so much care for. You can also use this treatment as overnight treatment and rinse it out the next day. So basically just apply it to your entire hair, cover your hair with a shower cap, then wash it out the next day. Once I'm done applying it to the scalp, I also apply it to the hair as well. I went ahead and massaged the scalp. Scalp massage is really beneficial for your hair as it promotes blood circulation which leads to hair growth. So the reason why I'm applying the treatment to the scalp is because this treatment helps with scalp issues. Rosemary leaves, ginger and aloe vera helps to treat dandruffs and infection on the scalp. If you want to grow your hair, you need to look after your scalp. Healthy scalp equals to hair growth. So make sure you apply this treatment to your scalp. Don't forget to apply it to your ends as well. I use my fingers to finger detangle that section. I twist that section and repeat the same process. Don't forget to also apply this hair growth treatment to your edges as well. Our edges are prone to breakage due to the pressure of protective style. So always make sure to apply any treatment to your edges as well. Once I'm done applying the treatment to the entire hair, I cover the hair with a shower cap for about 45 minutes. After 45 minutes, go ahead and rinse off the treatment and proceed with your wash day process. So guys, we have come to the end of this video. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already subscribed. Comment in the comment section if you have any questions for me. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Bye.